What's hanging ladies and gentlemen today? I have something super special for you guys and that is how to test out various mercs without having to purchase them or wait for free rotation. We'll also be talking about how to check out unreleased uh, and by unreleased I mean as of this date 7315 weapons and abilities so you can try them out for yourself. So what is the catch? Well, the catch is, you can't actually use them in live matches, but you can test them out in offline servers. Now, a lot of this video draws from a guy by Yazeth. Big thanks to the guy for letting me work with him on putting this video together. You know, this video is geared for those who learn better visually and prefer to watch the process done. Uh, we'll be dealing a lot with the description box of this video, so be sure to have that expanded. There's gonna be a lot of code options to refer to. Now, the very first thing we gotta do, guys, is to set up an empty offline server, which is pretty easy. So once you log into Dirty Bomb, what you wanna do is to hit the console key, which is the tilde key next to the number one. It's the little squiggly mark um, make sure you hit that you should see a big black screen so now that we have that opened up type in switch obj underscore xxx and you will replace xxx with like a map of your choice and i'll show them here on the screen but no worries i'll include a list of proper codes in the description so look there for a reference Alrighty, so now that we are in, you have a long list of options to choose from, which is great because check out the description box as I said earlier. Um, it'll show you like a list of mercs and the proper codes that corresponds to them. Remember to hit K for suicide, type in the new console command for the next merc you want to try, and then hit respond to try that new merc. So I'll give you guys an example here. Um, if I wanted to try out Vasily, for example, you would type in set. SG, player replication info, M, slot archetypes, covert ops, underscore one, gameplay, uh, pawns, A, covert ops, underscore one. Now, you can just really just copy paste that code from the description right into the console command, um, and then it should go. It's, it should be fine, just hit enter. You're good to go, hit K to suicide, and then spawn in as Vasily. Okay, so that was for Mercs, but now we want to try out different weapons and items and abilities and all that good stuff. So, you want to go back to the console command and just type in this. You want to type in switch level exe underscore overground. And the reason why we're using overground map is because it's a lot more stable for whatever reason. Thank you, Yazas, for testing this out. Um, so let's start with breaking this down, right? So you have a primary slot, which is going to be button 1 by default, secondary, button 2, melee key of course is 3, and your item key is going to be button 4. So the command for changing the primary slot, I'll put it on the screen right now, as well as the description. Um, it's just going to be set SG pawn primary weapons, uh, parentheses A underscore XXX. Um, and then for command for secondary slot, it's just gonna be the same thing except instead of primary weapons, you're gonna write down secondary weapons. And then for melee, same thing except for primary weapons, you gotta put down melee weapons. And finally, for the item slot, you gotta put down uh, the word items instead of primary weapons. Don't fret, if this sounds complicated, I'll put this all in the description box below uh, for the different commands or the different uh, things you wanna do. Now, for the XXX bit, you know, you want to replace that with a name of the item or weapon or ability you want to use. And that's all in code, and I have a great list for you guys here. I'll show you how to access this list in a second. Um, let me just get my computer set up here. Here we go. And so you'll see that you are on the uh, file finder here. Go to PC, local disk, C drive. For me, it's going to be under program files 86, Steam, 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 and then look for common, or sorry, not common, Steam apps. Now you look for common, then Dirty Bomb, and then check under uh, Shooter Game, and then Cooked PC. Now, you'll see a bunch of folders, but the ones you really want to look at uh, would be the weapons. As you can see, it's got a bunch of different codes for different weapons. I unfortunately don't know. Uh, <laughs> uh, I don't know what each and every single one of these correspond to, so you may have to just test out a lot of these. But some of them are obvious, like Rocket Launcher 01. I mean, obviously, that's going to be a Rocket Launcher. Um, uh, let's see, let me go back here. And there's also going to be stuff like items. Uh, you're going to have different items. Molotov 01. Uh, you can throw out a Molotov if you want. Uh, it's pretty awesome. Uh, check out also tools. Now, tools is going to be like the ability slot. Um, 
there's going to be different ones you can test out. And I haven't tested out all of these, but I am under the impression that some of them could crash your game. So don't freak out if your game, your game rather, just crashes. Uh, I'm just assuming that some of these haven't been implemented yet or whatever, so they're just a little wonky. But, you know, you're free to test out the ones that do work, obviously. Uh, so that wraps up today's video. You know, I try to make this whole process as seamless as possible by putting all this stuff in the description. Uh, I hope it helps. I hope it makes it less confusing. And for the stuff that isn't listed in the description, you can easily find it, the names of the stuff in the folders that I just talked about. Again, check out the written guide uh, by Yazeth in Steam. I'll go ahead and link it in the description box below on the end or something. Um, and as always, hit that like button and click subscribe if you like to see my content or more of it rather. And until next time guys, I'll see you around.